Charlene's on the most iconic Belgium chocolate. The art of mould had been invented about 100 years ago. And look at the great results you get with so much shine and colour. There are many applications to produce these perfect pralines with great results. First of all, a mould is left plain or decorated and then it's filled with pre-crystallised chocolate to make individual little chocolate shells. The chocolate shells are then filled with a nice soft textured filling. When the filling is set, the whole mould is then sealed with pre-crystallised chocolate. What I love about the perfect praline is you get this fantastic high gloss. All definition is totally filled in perfectly. There's no dull patches due to wrong cooling and there's no large air bubbles due to over crystallisation. So if we look at the base of the chocolate you can see it's totally smooth, no gaps so there's no leakages. So if we cut a praline in half you can see we get this beautiful fine layer of chocolate all the way round, beautiful smooth filling and there's no gap between the filling and the base of the chocolate. So I'm going to take a smaller piece and I'm just going to eat it. Mm. So what we get first of all is the beautiful crack of that outer shell and then the soft centre just totally melts in the mouth and then the outer shell of the chocolate just totally melts itself, giving that lovely, rich, smooth silkiness of chocolate. So just see what you can achieve with a little imagination. So every counter will look fantastic with this array of um, chocolates. So you can see some nice classical moulded chocolates, some classical moulded chocolates, a bit of a twist, just some finger work with dark chocolate and then shell with milk, and then a total array of colour here. So we do loads of splashing with cocoa butter colours, airbrush spraying, and then just dusting in creative powders. So a massive delight for anyone visiting your chocolate counter.